do you really have a point of order? Sure about it? Okay, sit down. Point of order. Okay, Mr. Derek O'Brien, your point of order. Sir. Please sit down. Yes, sir. Professor, I have, I have, Take it. I have a point of order today, sir. Mm -hmm. Page 91, 261 and 262, regarding the expunging of words used in Parliament. I have got two examples, sir, which we can quickly correct. 261, what can be used, what can't be used. Sir. What is your point of order? That about the words being used in Parliament, just now. What is your point of order? These words need to be... A... What is point of order? My point Derek. of order is the... Sir, my Derek. point of order is in Rule 261. Derek, one second, one second. Is, no, no. One is second. the word... One minute, sir. One second, sir. one second, one second. I know. Raghav, take your seat. Just one second, Raghav. Is, is something wrong with your... Is something wrong with your seat? It, yeah. Every time you jump... Sir, I have been waiting for my time. Derek, one second. Sir, my point of order is... I get your point. On the words which can be used in this house or not. That's it. my limited point of order. I'm, I'm going to give you 261, 262. Right. Two examples. Yes, sir. Very fine. But what is the point of order? The point... Lord, sir... Please, three words, three words, three words were expunged. I'm going to give you four words. Yesterday we said the Prime Minister should open his mouth on Manipur. Is Prime Minister got expunged? Manipur got expunged. Why? Is expunged? Sir, one second, one second. One second, one second. No, no, one second.